Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's Monkozonki, and I'm at the KBD. Uh, I've actually never been here before. This is the first time I've ever been to the KBD. Um, I don't know why I've never been here before, because it's, like, the oldest boss, and, like, this is what level 60s come and kill, and think they're awesome. No offense if you're level 60 and you just kill the KBD and you think you're awesome. You are. But, uh, what I'm saying is, like, I've never been here before. I have no idea why. I mean, I've even been to the Calphite Queen several times. Never to the KBD. And so far, it is not much different from a regular black dragon I guess except that you actually take a little bit of damage from the fire because um, the anti-fire potions don't completely protect you but I thought I'd just bring a war tortoise so I actually wouldn't like lose money here and I thought hey why not vid it you know I didn't really see any reason not to so that's what I'm doing um, I almost thought oh crap I forgot to teleport out but then I remember uh, aim of the glory luckily that thing was charged otherwise I'd have to like home tell you out of here that would not be good um, yeah, so I don't think anyone really kills this thing anymore. I guess it has been updated in the last six years, because there's a summoning obelisk here, and summoning is, uh, has came out since after the release of the KBD. Um, I brought Poison Purge, just in case. Thought that might be a good idea. Um, I have no idea why I've never been to this boss before. It just, it never really crossed my mind to go here, I guess. Um, oh, Resistance Dragonfire right now, that's not good. Um, yeah, I'm... Like, this thing just gets torn by uh, Rapier and Extremes and Turmoil. Um, I'm wearing Welfare gear because obviously you do have to go into the wilderness. And, like, you never know. There might be some maging ass bag that just happens to have TBs on him up, t you know, by the um, K KBD's lair. You never know. It could happen. So I thought, you know, why not just play it safe? I'd rather not lose my bank. So, uh, yeah. Anyways, I thought this might be somewhat fun to record, just because I don't really have any idea of what else to record today. I've been, a, been getting a little bit bored of RuneScape, like, not overall, just today. You know, it's just one of those days where you're, you're like, ah, I don't really feel like playing RuneScape today. I feel like goofing off, so that's what I'm doing, really. Um, I think this actually might be fun to, like, do a Black Dragon task on. I might try that someday. Um, I haven't had a Black Dragon task for a long, long time, but... Uh, if I do, it's actually decent charms, too, because it drops uh, four charms per kill, so... Um, I haven't really had to eat any food at all, hardly, so... Yeah, um, I'm guessing, like, without a yak, it's not really possible to stay here for a long amount of time, because I don't want to just leave all the bones and hides on the ground, because that's where, like, 90% of the profit comes from here, so... Yeah, I'm, I, that's the reason why I brought along the war tortoise, just to store those in here. I really wish I had a yak, to be honest, but hey, this thing is helping me get a yak. Eight crimsons, four blues, that's not bad. A few more crimsons and blues would be very welcome, but I'm okay with gold and greens as well. Um, I'll just store these other things in the tortoise, because I'm not going to drop them or anything, so. Um, I guess I'll record a couple more kills. I'll just call this, like, Monkozunky's first experience with the KBD. Um, and to my knowledge, the KBD was the only boss released in RuneScape Classic. I'm not sure if the Calphite Queen came out in RuneScape Classic, but I'm I'm pretty sure that Calphite Queen either came out with the release, the full release, not the beta release, of uh, RuneScape 2. I'm not completely touched up on my RuneScape history. Sorry, I didn't play back when RuneScape 2 was first released. I joined a little bit after that, but... um. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure the KBD was the only boss in um, RuneScape Classic, which is pretty cool, because uh, I think D-Meds on RuneScape Classic are still worth, like, 1 mil, and 1 mil on RuneScape Classic is a lot more than it is um, currently. Obviously, because uh, there weren't as many coins in the game back then, so money wasn't worth as much. And Poison Purge is pretty much healing me as much damage as this thing is doing, which uh, is completely alright with me. Also, my throat is really, really dry. I need a drink. Um... I should probably go get one after I'm done killing a few more of these things. And I'll do, like, one more kill for the the whole the YouTube thing, and then we'll be done. More Iron Arrows, that's cool. Those are stackable. I like stackable stuff. Um, store this stuff in my tortoise. And I'm going to pause just because my throat is really, really in pain right now. I'd rather not uh, kill myself while waiting for the next KBD to spawn. So after the next KBD spawns, I'll resume. This will be my last kill, not of the trip, but just the last one I'm going to record because I seriously doubt I'm actually going to get anything all that interesting from this boss. But hey, I I made money at least. It wasn't a loss. Um, one nice thing about this KBD thing, it is kind of fun. So I would recommend like coming here if you got a 
a buddy or two and you're just bored and don't really know what else to do on RuneScape at the moment. And also, um, for one thing, you don't lose money like Cal Fight Queen, because Cal Fight Queen you have to go through a lot of food at that boss, and you end up just losing more money on supplies than you end up making from drops, mostly because there really aren't any drops. Um, but this is a bit of fun. You do make a little bit of money, not a whole lot. It's not uh, anything spectacular. And then um, also it, it's easy, you know. The thing with Cal Fight Queen, for one, it hits so hard. And for two, the spawns take so long that um, I don't really know if it's worth it, <laughs> to be completely honest. Like, Cal Fight Queen is kind of fun to just like go in a mass, you know, when you're bored and just want to mess around. But... uh. I think this boss is more fun just solo or duo with a buddy. So, yeah, that's about all for this video. My first experience here. It was fun. I enjoyed it. My screen's spazzing out. I love being able to drag it with the drag it with the middle mouse button. It's so much fun. Anyways, uh, hopefully everyone enjoyed, and I will see you tomorrow with a new video. And the other two videos that I should be uploading today. Hopefully, don't forget. Farewell.